Finally, I can test my skills alongside the real Valkyrie expert. First off, Hellwalkers are nothing compared to Valkyries. Second, I thought you didn't believe me. the Valkyries. I just don't believe it was Grandfather who corrupted them, or that he caused the desolation in Midgard, or that he had all the giants killed. Am I missing anything? Uh, lots, actually. crimes as my grandfather committed. Let's see. He decimated Vanaheim, tortured Tyr, murdered Groa, murdered Amir. It goes on and on. Interesting. And where'd you hear all this? Freya and Mimir told me. Oh, so his traitorous ex-wife and a bitter former advisor. Got it. Look, you don't believe me, but... No, I don't. Either you're full of crap or you're a hypocrite for helping him. Can we just focus on the mission? Dead end. This is where the mask said to go? Let's double back. We'll find a way around. See? More Hellwalkers! That means we're headed the right way! Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, there's a big hole up there now. Could be our way around. Maybe we can I use got the this. big crate. Uh huh. Sure you do. Hey, we're okay, right? I guess. Maybe our families are just meant to be enemies. Well, not us. I don't believe that. What I do believe is that you'll make a great Valkyrie. I'll tell your mom the same thing. Even if she scares the life out of me. Now, we have a masterpiece to find. No way through up here either. Now what? I'm not sure. But my gut's telling me what we need is here. I'm really myself a bow. Hidden one's easy. Hidden good at shooting at the hard one. Maybe you can show me. I'll be the first Valkyrie archer. Heal. It fell through the floor. Could be our way up. Let's head back down and find out. Now we go right. Into a group of Hellwalkers. Let's get them! This way is blocked too. There has to be another way. Keep your eyes peeled. Yeah. Let's go. What's the mask say? So. The mask's pull is a little weird with all these buildings in the way, but I think we're going the right way. You think?
So this way? Uh, sure. Are you messing with me? I need this to go well. I need my family to see what I can do. I know. We both do. Mask? Uh, looks like it's through here. Let me get that for you. <laughs> okay, this thing is really fighting me. See anything in there? There. Whatever you shot crashed through the floor again. Let's head back and check it out. So, I talk about my mom a lot. What's your dad like? He's intense. Like he's trying to force me into this mold. But I'm not sure that's me. Oof. Well, I know exactly what that's like. Thing is, I don't know what I want. I love that you do. You'll figure it out. Which way? The mask showed it was straight ahead earlier. But of course the way's blocked. Maybe they're trying to keep people out. Or something in. I bet there's another way around. There always is. more soundstone. You know what to do. Sweet. So, how'd you know you wanted to be a Valkyrie? 
I didn't always. After a bad fight with Mom, I snuck out and found them training. Somehow, every movement they made had such purpose, like they knew exactly where they needed to be. And in that moment, so did I. So, where to now? Looks like it's through here. So training gave me... Too heavy? Shut up. Something's blocking it. I'll take a look. But I want to hear the rest. Deal. Not bad. I know. As I was saying, seeing the Valkyries fight... Oh, strength and style, no apologies. It gave me clarity. The first time I saw that forward, Thursday. <sighs> Too bad giants have to follow prophecy. Who cares? Make your own path, just like we've been doing here. Step aside, little man. <sighs> this one's stuck too! But I feel it weakening. Looks like it. Bring it on! you now?
Looks like it's through here. But it's blocked. What if I go this? Aha! Can you get up there? See if you can find a way to cut the crate down on the other side. I'll wait here. I don't have a fancy way up like you do. Got it. Ingrid, was I too rude about her grandfather? She should know the truth, right? Yeah, guess so. Hey, you talking to me? Uh, no, just talking to Ingrid. Okay, well, I'm waiting. Let's see, how can I get a better view of that crate? Get back. Hey, what's going on out there? You okay? I got it. Got it, boy, Loki. Mess him up. Yapa. open. Let's go. Whoa. The mask is freaking out. We must be close. <sighs> what was that? Don't look at me. You're the one who's been here before. It's probably nothing. Doesn't sound like nothing. Besides, I don't think it's dangerous. Are we looking at the same thing? Maybe. He's locked up for a good reason. I can feel what he's feeling. It's a giant thing. Look, he just wants to be free. A piece he must be behind him. Trust me. There we 
we go. Heavy sleeper. Let's do the next. another one under his foot. You're welcome, mangy mutt. Let's look in the chamber he was guarding. Down in the water or something? There's... How? It's not responding anymore. This has never happened. But you said trust you. And we let that thing loose. Grandfather's gonna kill me. We gotta get out of here. Come on. Through. Wait up. I knew you missed it. Maybe it's back here. Through. Through. It's gonna be okay. How I... can you say that? I shouldn't have listened to you. Look, if I made a mistake, I'll fix it. I can find the piece. holes between realms, right? <laughs> well, I suppose I should expect nothing less from half-breeds. Don't call me a half-breed. <clears throat> I will call you whatever I like, Junior. Leave him alone. It was a mistake. No! The mistake was allowing you to think that you were ready. You helped him, didn't you? What side are you on anyway, Guppy? Try me and find out. Oh. <laughs> and what are you going to do exactly? <sighs> you see, Everyone takes it easy on you, because they are afraid of your father. I am not. That fat, drunken, utter piece of trash! Hey! Again! Yes, yes, the dumb does not fall far from the tree. Very well, then. Give me your best shot. have a lot to learn, little girl, starting with who your family is and who it is not. Just wait until I'm a Valkyrie. <laughs> oh. You really believe the Allfather would allow that to happen? <sighs> Please. Do not let this little weasel feed your delusions any longer. Enough! <laughs> so close. Stop! He just wants to make you mad. Yeah? Well, it worked. <sighs> well, uh, you toddlers are boring. If you are finished throwing your little tantrum, we should go now. Because I cannot wait to watch you explain this mess to the author. Oh, it's going to be glorious. Boogan! Damn it. 
He's not here. Let's check his study. Oh, boy, is he going to lose it. Father will have my back. After the Allfather sent him away sulking with his tail between his legs? Doubtful. And you, Loki of the Oatnar. I am haunted by your incompetence. It keeps me up at night. Whatever. <laughs> no, I... Seriously, I, I find the hues and shades of your shortcomings almost... moving. If we could only somehow harness your uselessness, we could fuel this entire city. Fine. It's all on me. Just leave her out of it. I don't need your help, Loki. Sorry. Save it for the Allfather. We have a lot to discuss. Loki, I'll meet you in your room when I'm finished here. Shouldn't be long. Okay. My mission went quite well, Allfather. Secured the item we've discussed. The mask, on the other hand, well. Thanks a lot. Throod, I... I don't want to hear it. Everything was fine until you showed up. I'll make it up to you, I swear. I don't really want to talk right now. What did you think would happen? She hates me, Thor. My little... You can't keep undermining me like that. Training her behind my back? She's gonna do what she wants. Wouldn't you rather I at least help? Know where she's going, keep her safe. No, I'd rather us be a team. I'd like you to back me up for once. You're ruining what little relationship I have left with her. I'm doing the best I can to keep this family together. If that were true, you'd stand up to your father for once in your life. You're right. Honey. No. You're right. What kind of example am I setting? Seems the only thing I can do right these days is destroy everything around me. We just... We need you here. I need you. I can't do this by myself. I really messed up. It's times like this I really miss home. Ingrid, did you have a home? Before you came here? Someone who took care of you? That sounds like a yes. Maybe I could help you find them without, you know, screwing it up. Sound like a plan? May I come in? I heard what Heimdall had to say. I'd like to hear it from you. What happened? It wasn't there. I was wrong. Well, we all make mistakes, son. But freeing Garm, <laughs> that was a big one. Chaos is already spilling out into the other realms. We're safe here in Asgard. But everywhere else. I think I want to go home now. Okay. 
if that's what you want. I meant it when I said you're not a prisoner here. It's your choice. Go, clear your mind. I know you'll be back. But before you go, I'll need the mask back. It's not that I don't trust you, you understand. It's the company you keep. Oh, and Ingrid? Please, I need to go. Loki, when you do decide you're ready to continue our work here, Hugen will be waiting for you in your old home. You screwed up. Doesn't change the fact that you're welcome here. Oh, and say hi to Mimir for me. Never thought I'd be so relieved to be back here. If you're staying, you might be waiting a while. gateway quick. Odin was right. Freeing Garm. How did I screw up so bad? Okay. Guess it's time to face him. No running away this time. Almost home. It's gonna be fine. Everything's fine. That's 
No thanks to you. Where is Atreus? Atreus? Has the runaway returned and brought all this with him? God, just hold still. I told you I'm fine. Oh, you're bleeding. And quit your blubbering. So my fault. The Hell Walkers. They're everywhere. Everywhere. That is not your fault. Yes, it is. There was a wolf in hell. He was in chains and. And I set him free. I, I thought that if. Garm! Great bleeding fuck lad, you freed Garm! Garm? Who freed Garm? That's madness. Surely not you, young one. If the Hound of Hell is loose, he'll chew through the fabric of the realms. Hellwalkers are just the beginning. What were you thinking? Aye, this is a fuck-up of not insignificant proportions. What would drive you to such mischief? Is this Loki's doing? Enough. Leave him. Atreus has made a mistake. One that we will fix together. Grand. Now, if you don't mind, I'd rather stay here. I've had my fill of visits to Helheim. One problem. Excuse I'm not sure I have a way back to Elon. Perhaps the squirrel does. I need to speak with you at once. At once, I say. Gentlemen, I apologize for my brusque tone, but whatever has lately transpired in Helheim is completely unacceptable. I must insist you remedy the situation without further delay. I implore you, return to Helheim post-haste and undo whatever it is you've done! And, might I add, never do it again. Well, as little further delay as possible, then. Sindri, you okay? What happened to your head? Are you kidding? You did this! I did? Yes, with your uh, bear claws. I, I didn't know. Hey, 
Don't you two start up again. Can't you see my head pounding? I'm here for you. Their deaths will be painless. Ish. That ought to hurt him. Strike true. Cool. Their deaths will be painless. Ish. What can I make for you? I'll disinfect my tools. Dane's legacy. It's said that once drawn, it can't be sheathed until it takes a life. Bit of an exaggeration. The Cutter of Hearts and the Fury of the Sky. What about your son? Need something?
Well, I see that whole stop something bad from happening plan worked just like magic. Enough. And if you must imperil the fabric of reality in the future, please do the courtesy of notifying me. And do try not to fuck up. You gonna, you know, reprimand me? No. I am relieved. You are safe. Okay. Wow. Maybe I should run away more often. Atreus. Kidding. Sorry. So where'd the new spear come from? Brock made it. From Dropnir. What's that? A ring. But what's its story? I do not know. You were not there to ask. He's probably just scared. He was chained up for a really long time. We can't hurt him, okay? A desperate creature can be the most dangerous. I know. Gotta get across before he opens up more realm tips. <laughs> Can we use fear knock out that piece of the wall? Looks fragile enough. What? No. Why? Are you not working with him? It's not what you think. Whatever he promised, he cannot be trusted. I don't. But he has something I need. It's hard to explain. Should 
sure you got all the weak spots? from your wings still didn't work I see that another perspective maybe something you missed <laughs> You to trust me. I know I have no right to act. Can you anyway? What does he have that you need? Why can you not tell me? It's complicated. What about you? Why do you have a new weapon? I thought you didn't want war. I do not. But it's complicated. Everyone keeps secrets. Sometimes it's the only way to protect the ones we love. And don't worry about Odin. I'm not going back there. That is good to hear. A round tear. The arm's been busy. I think I understand how Freya closed one. Keep the enemies away if you can. I can. Let me know when you're ready. All those hell walkers up there. We find Garm. Last Yeah! 
Translating things for Odin. There's this mask he found and a magical rift that's connected to it. It's all sort of complicated. Yeah. But I met people my age there. Made friends. I think we're still friends. You cannot trust those loyal to Odin. It's not always bad to trust people. It compromises your judgment. Maybe. But I'm tired of feeling alone. Atreus, I... Let's just figure out how this gate works. Okay? when the gate is up. Use money where they can chain elements. I think we're going to need more than one sigil. Sigil arrows don't work on that. Yes. Enemy on the left! Stop him. This is all my fault. I see a notch in the pillar here that your spear can probably fit. But we need a better angle.
Alka!
Atreus. I want you to feel alone. But your decision to go to Asgard helped me understand. Odin doesn't want Ragnarok. I, I know I can't trust him, but I needed his help. I can't let Ragnarok happen either. I would have helped you. I know. Wait, he's right here! Okay, okay! It's okay, boy. It's all right. Just calm. Calm. We, we just want to... Squeeze through here. <sighs> if Odin truly wishes to avoid Ragnarok. Then we are in agreement. Yeah? Then what's that spear for? To protect you. Don't you have other weapons for that? guys doing here? They are dead. Oh, yeah. Traveler. I hate Who fighting these guys.
If you're not preparing for Ragnarok... Seriously, why the spear? I shared. It's your turn. We are not the same. I am the parent. You're ducking the question. What up there? Close. Promise me you won't kill him, okay? I make no promises, but I will try not to kill the beast. forward but looks like there's a notch in the wall
What is your plan? I'm sort of making it up as I go. But you're not talking about Varm. You cannot outsmart Odin. It's worked so far. Has it? I'm gonna try to tame it. Tame it? Sure. I've tamed wolves before. I'll just track on. You freeze his chains with your axe if he can't run and latch him onto something. No, too dangerous. It's a good plan. Let's move. Ugh. Wait. Transformation. Did Odin teach you to control it? No. We will not rely on what he taught you. Next time, we do it my way. Yes, sir. up on purpose, did you? Now who does not trust? Sorry, that wasn't fair. I just, I thought it would work. Patience. We will find a way. I think we need to get up to that ledge up there. How? There is always a way. <laughs> Do you see? Oh, why didn't I think of that? The solution is not always obvious. Yeah! 
Your way means... It means what you think it means. But can't we try and... We have the power to limit the harm this creature can cause. We will use it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> 
didn't have to end that way. It's my fault he got loose. That he's dead. Sometimes there is no other way. I know. Go home now. Atreus. I know. I close my heart to it. Open. The gear's behind that gate. There's got to be a way to freeze it, right? I guess sigil arrows don't work on that. We can use my sigils to carry the frost to the gear. Well, you are gone. I sought the noise. They told me Heimdall intended to kill you in Asgard. Heimdall? The Norns? I thought you didn't believe in that. Oh, my God. 
keep flooding the realms. The realms will collapse. You must learn to calm your mind. Maybe I've learned I run better on fail. What else did you learn? We work better when we trust each other. We gotta find him. Come on. 
Well, I guess he came this way. Let's find another way up. What did you do? At the house. The spell you saw me do in Fenrir died. I didn't know it then. But I accidentally put his soul into my knife. Souls are powerful, so I thought maybe Fenrir's could... Change its nature. Yeah. Let's see if it's up. When I found you in Midgard, before Freya attacked, you said you needed to protect me. Why? I saw a prophecy. You were... in my arms. Dead. I saw it too. In Jotunheim. What? You knew? That's why you've been training me so hard. One day, you will have to survive without me. Not gonna happen. I won't let it. I won't. All journeys come to an end. Not ours. Not like that. It's over now. I promise. Fen? Are you? you too. Didn't know if that would work. We did it. Sit. How is this possible? It's giant magic. I've been learning things. In Asgard. This has nothing to do with that. More secrets. No. A promise. We that someone's trusting me to keep. Like you kept your promise to Mom? See what I can do when you trust me? Oh. Isn't it? It is. I'm a jerk. But that's not who you are anymore, right? A god killer? You don't want war. No. But I will do what it takes to keep you safe. <laughs> <laughs> Flower here. 
My guess is so blossom. Open. Maybe we can use the sigils to freeze the gear up there. Alka. Guess sigil arrows don't work on that. Father, if you can't trust the fates, why do you care what they say? When it comes to your life, I can take no chances. These runes. The gateway got buried. I have it. What's wrong? Without you, I got reckless, overconfident, made stupid mistakes. I don't know why I thought I could do this alone. You were right. No. On our journey together, you have grown into a warrior, worthy of your namesake. I was the one who was not ready. You don't have to be who you were just because I'm not there. Let's make a promise. I'll listen for your voice in my head when you're not there to guide me. And you do the same. All right? I 
I need to know you'll be okay without me. Don't be sorry, Father. Be better. Let's go home. Prophecy define our choices. Then we will make our own destiny. Did you want to take care of anything before going back to Sindri's? No. First. We retrieve Mamir. Then you can tell us what you learned in Asgard. After that, we shall see. You really do think of him as a brother. What about Freya? Seems like she moved in while I was away. Once she turned her hatred back to Odin, she recognized our interests were aligned. Huh. I tried convincing her of that, but... When was that? Oh. Before I started telling you where I was that night. I see. Hey. She didn't kill me. I said nothing. You're back. How did it go? We should travel us no further. Well, that's our bloody relief. So you put down old Garm, did you? Yeah. Sort of. Atreus, your decision to go to Asgard after all he's put us through. I'll never understand it. But I hope you at least came back with something we can use. I hope so, too. Come on. Let me show you what Odin's up to. Here's what he cares about most. More than Ragnarok or anything is this mask. Anyone recognize it? That thing? Ugh, oh, it's a dead end. He's been faffing around with that since before I knew him. To be honest, I thought the giants were just having a laugh with that one. Okay, fine. No. You're wrong, Mimir. This mask is no fraud. The giants didn't make it, and only a few of them ever glimpsed it in their visions. They never knew its origin, but some believed it was a way to gaze into the secrets of creation itself. Is it an oracle? Much, much more. Imagine becoming one with a source of infinite knowledge. This? This is why Odin tortured me. So what do you think? Know it? No. It's one obsession he never saw fit to share with me. But I'll tell you this. Even when Odin speaks the truth, his purpose is false. Either way, it's a mistake to let it distract us. Is Heimdall our focus or not? We will rewrite our fate another way. Then I'm going back to Vanaheim. If we're not taking the fight to Odin, I should help my brother stand against him. We will join our 
when we can. Father, I'm gonna study my notes on the mask. See if I can think of a plan. But if you want to go anywhere, I'm with you. And listen, everyone. I'm really sorry about the way I left. You know I've never hurt any of you on purpose. Well, when you can turn into a bear by accident, I suppose these things can happen. So, do you forgive me? Of course, Atreus. We know you meant no harm, lad. Sindri? I'm sure I will. Eventually. Okay. Guess I'll take it. While we're clearing the air, I hope that I can be forgiven for not doing more when the Hellwalkers attacked. Whatever reservations I have about violence, they shouldn't apply when your home is under attack. And certainly not by undead abominations. Yet I reached for a shield instead of a sword. You were right to chide me for that, old friend. The next time the moment calls me, I'll be ready. Well said, Tyr. I believe you just might. Let me upgrade our axe for you. Can't stand to see it looking like that. Brother, before we check on Freya, is there any unfinished business in other realms you wanted to take care of? I'm sure the lad would love to help. You make up your mind. Well, take more than a port full of bone John stiffs to keep me down. What am I gonna do? Walk around with a bandage on my head, begging for attention? I was mauled by a bear. Nudged, more like it.
I'm just gonna keep working on this till you're ready to head out. Care to join me, Kratos? Have a seat, think about your breathing, try and find stillness in your mind? No. Hey, wait! We're with you. For you. The Hound of Hell is no longer a threat. Indeed. You have proven worthy of great responsibility, Master Kratos. Please forgive me if I've been abrupt or at all impertinent of late. The loss of Madame Neathog weighed heavily upon me, even before the grave uncertainties of this Garm episode. I do sincerely apologize for my rude demeanor during this time. I did not notice. You are being polite, of course. My demeanor was impudent, borderline cruel. Surely this was a source of some discomfort for you. No. My conversational wounds run deep then, and you would hide the scars. I swear, Master Kratos, I will make it up to you someday. Should I have anything else for you, you'll be the first to know. I'm away with you already! do you know of the mask? Only that it was the great passion of Odin's life. He journeyed across... Adia's burning ocean into the heart of the silent matron herself to find it. Lost every man in his crew, but to hear him tell it, it was worth all that blood and more.
now that I've spent time in Asgard, it's strange to imagine Magni and Modi. Sif raised them both, right? She seems like a good mom. Maybe a little overprotective. A good mother? Not the Sif I knew. In a culture as debaucherous as the Aesir, being a paragon of womanhood meant being a fierce fighter and a fiercer drinker. She and Thor seldom knew a moment's sobriety, whether brutally dealing with their enemies or, just as brutally, raising those boys. What do you mean? Oh, little brother. I know you didn't have an easy childhood, but you can't fathom how much worse it can get. Let this wait. Stay. Alert. Wasting my breath over his berserker champions, even less so. Tra a lot of them. <sighs> Why wait until now to speak of them? Before there was. <laughs> Nothing to be done. But finding that hill changed <sighs> things. <sighs> mask. How did he hear about it in the first place? He said a voice spoke to him one night, entreated him to collect the mask and control his own fate. I still think it's all a bunch of bollocks. Odin got drunk, convinced himself a wooden mask would solve all his problems, and pranced about the realms until he found a sufficiently mysterious bauble to fit the bill. Mask probably doesn't do anything at all. Yeah, probably.
Doing that, is he? Yeah. Is he like charming the steel or casting a spell or something? No. Just a weird bloke. <laughs> You can yell at me, if you want. We're leaving. And what would that accomplish? I make you feel better. No. You didn't trust me enough to talk through your worries. That's a wound not easily mended. I'm sorry. You needn't be. 
Fault is mine. Father's new spear. It's made out of a ring? Drop me an eye. Forged by the Hulder brothers as a gift for Odin. How's it work? Every so often, the Drop Near drips out identical copies of itself. The Huldras presumably figured that if one golden ring was a good gift, an infinite number of them would earn them a permanent place in Odin's heart. But it didn't. Not even a little. I met someone I liked. How would I know if they, uh, liked me too? Is there someone? I... no. I was just curious. Actually, doesn't matter. It's... doesn't matter. Mimir, you were explaining how bad it got for Magni and Modi being... ...raised by Thor and Sif while they were drinking. I want to understand. Well, imagine learning discipline by having thrashed into you time and again. That was Thor's approach, the same one Odin used on him. A poisonous notion of manhood passed down through generations. A grim inheritance, leaving all of them the poorer. Well, Sif doesn't drink anymore. Neither of them do. I am quietly flabbergasted to hear it. And time to walk. The story will keep. Lad, I'm still reeling from what you said earlier about Thor and Sif having quit drinking. I get the sense it's more recent for him, but I know he loves his daughter. I expect that's the explanation. Sif goes straight, hopes that raising a good daughter will redeem their past failures. Thor struggles. Maybe she gives him an ultimatum after some breaking point or other. What he did to Modi, that night he found us. Oh, that's a deft guess, lad. And if that ultimatum worked, well, good for them. <laughs> sure. I think there's another realm tear guard made over there. Oh! 
Nicely done. <laughs> Brothers, how did you manage to kill Garm anyway? We killed him a few times actually, but it didn't take. And I figured maybe the way to stop a soulless beast was to give it a soul. So I gave it the one I had on me. I beg your pardon? Fenrir, remember the light father saw? The accidental magic I did when Fenrir died? That was part of Fenrir's soul going into my knife. Once I figured that out, I just put Fenrir into Garn. <laughs> Clever one, lad! A gigantic hell beast with the soul of a loyal pup. Bloody brilliant! Amir, did you know Garm? Why was he locked up to begin with? Ah, Hell's feral sentinel. Well, believe it or not, Midgard was once bigger. Until Garm, then just a wee pup got mechish. He ate Midgard? Only a few mountain ranges. And the fifth season that comes after winter but before spring. And the word for the feeling when you get so hungry, you stop being hungry. You're him messing with me. I would never.
So, Mimir, how did they capture Garm in the first place? That was Tears do it. He lured the beast somewhere safe and kept it distracted by lending his own arm to be gently chewed. Once the chains were on and the gate to Elheim was opened, Garm bit Tears' arm clean off in retribution. But Tears not missing an arm. Well, it grew back, eventually. He is a very resourceful god, after all. Lad, am I right in getting the sense you've actually gotten to know Thor's daughter somewhat? Yeah, dude's great. Wants to be a Valkyrie one day. And she deserves to be. Of course, I told her all about the Valkyries we faced, but I'm not sure how much she believes me. It didn't go great when I tried to tell her stories about her... ...grandfather, though. Anyone can have a blind spot when it comes to family. Some only learn the truth in the hardest way. Uh, it's true. What you meant when you asked about Viking. Through? No. I mean, I wasn't asking about anyone specific. And, well, Skilder likes through. But she's only interested in becoming a Valkyrie. She's focused, you know? Well, very well, lad. Very well. Just hope you know if you ever need to review anything we've discussed. <laughs> I know. It's good. And fine.
Great. You gonna check in on Freya? Yes. Glad I get to come this time. So what happened the last time you were in Vanaheim? I still don't know how you got Freya to stop trying to kill you. We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed, she accepted that I was not her enemy. You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freya's camp. You met Freya? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks her conviction. True. But he's a bit quicker to forgive. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's in the right place. You'll like him, lad. Wow. It's beautiful. And, uh, wet. It is also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? That barricade wasn't there last time. Freya's group has been busy. Freya's camp is to the right. No rush, is that? Not every day the lack. See a new realm. I'm sure it's fine to check in on Fair later. Yo! 
to Freya's camp then. Time to see how the Vanir have fared in our absence. I hope Freya's okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her though? Her brother's forces are outnumbered, and there is much I owe her. No one here. Where is everyone? Stay alert. I don't like this, brother. Kratos, Atreus, a welcome reunion. Unexpected, but welcome. You know us? Can't be. Is that who I think? Oh, you shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man, or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, piss-drunk, oversexed liar. He was more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. Do you not recognize your handiwork? Hildas Vini! Remember when we first met Frey in the woods? After I... Oh... I am so... so sorry about that. Freya's boar. Her advisor. And friend. Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. And then you shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. My hide's not so thick in this form. We can head out whenever you're ready. Where are we going? I have a favor to ask. I'll explain on the way. Where's Freya? She came... ...here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freya and Big Fear. They've been captured by the Ainher Yard. Hey, that happened. An ambush. The presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy, tracking time with no moon in the sky. No moon. Just like in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You'd have my gratitude. We're spread thin. And if anyone can help Skoll and Hati, it'd be a fellow giant. Very well. Freya mentioned... way past this. You don't disappoint. Continue down this path and you'll find her dead. Good luck. And don't shoot any boars. You think he's really forgiven me for shooting him? Trust me, lad. The old swine still carried a grudge. You'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual. Miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken promises. Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. Just curious. Curiosity's all well and good. But so is privacy, eh? Okay, okay. Point taken. Ah! 
termine her. Go! Yapa! Who are team? and feels so different from the other realms. It's warm, like Svartalfan, but there's a kind of thickness in the air. Hmm. Egros. Uh, what? Egros. Greek. For humid. Egros. I like it. Going for more loot, huh? I saw a forge back at Freyr's camp. Has Brock been helping them out this whole time? Ah, you haven't met Lunda yet. An old contemporary of the Huldra brothers. She serves as Freyr's blacksmith. Keep it.
Team armed and outfitted. Oh, another legendary blacksmith? I bet you... She has some good stories. Take caution, Atreus. What? Why? She is quite... <laughs> friendly. <laughs> oh, nonsense. The lad's far too young for her taste. Uh, <laughs> what? I think we can get through here. You know, lad, this excursion into Vanai means you've now visited each of the Nine Realms. Huh. I guess you're right. Not many mortals can claim such a feat. Not many gods either. Even your father has yet to grace the halls of Asgard. I'm in no hurry to do so. Hilda's Venus. That Freyr and Bigvir were captured. Who's Bigvir? He's a light elf, a former scholar exiled from Alfheim with his wife Bela. She may be their best warrior. Why was he exiled? You'll have to ask him for the full tale. But I take it that he and Bela's quest to unite their people was. Frowned upon. Wait, Bela's a dark elf? Yes. Wow. Well, that raises even more questions. Hope he's okay.
I know you. The barricades. Aye, not a good sign. They've pushed farther into the jungle since our last visit.
once told us Ragnarok began when the storm hockey catches the sun and the moon, right? I said it was foretold, lad. Prophecy. <laughs> Which, after our time with the Norns, we've all had quite enough of. But Odin still believes. That's gotta be why the Einherjar stole the moon. He's still trying to avoid Ragnarok. Or he prepares for it. Fights a proxy war in this realm to distract his enemies. Yeah. Or that, I guess. I can sense them up there. It's gotta be their den. Excited to meet Skull and Hati, lad. I mean, I've heard all your stories. It's gonna be weird meeting them in person. Legend meeting reality. At the very least, it shouldn't fail to entertain. They're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves. Supremely entertaining, as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right. Well, best we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? As if that's a perfectly normal thing to say. The Aenor Yar played a part according to Skull and Hathi's shrine. Managed to stuff the moon inside a box, if memory serves. But it didn't say where they took the box. Aye, that's the rub of using prophecy as a map, isn't it? Bit sparse on the details. There's a war camp in the nearby village. A strong fortress to guard their bounty. We will try there first. So besides Hildas Vini and the elves, who else is part of Freya's army? Not much army, really. Although Beergirl was a soldier, one walk in the path of a traveler. I imagine he's handy with that enormous broken sword of his. A traveler that doesn't want to kill us. That's nice.
I didn't know they could do that. A new enemy. Stay alert. Yeah? Correct. Hmm. Fitting. Again. Guess they know we're coming. I can't believe no one's here. They hide. Vanier aren't all hardened warriors like our dear Freya. Those who survive the warfare find it easier to hide in the jungle and use nature as their shield. Definitely an ambush. Yes. We can get to it from up here.
a dent in Odin's forces, at least for the time being. I don't think Asgard's running out of soldiers anytime soon. Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay, yeah. That is a weird thing to say. <laughs>
the waterfall. Behind you, father! She's still up there. Another end. Bush. Really? That time's the chance. They are not smart. I understand. You know, what we're doing right now, all of this, it's almost exactly how we saw it play out back in Skull and Hati Shrine. The wolves are back in Vanaheim. We're rescuing the moon. Yes. I remember the prophecy. So, doesn't it make you worried? Everything we're doing now happened in the Yonar Shrine. Remember our agreement. Prophecy will not dictate our actions. Yeah. Our allies need help. That is our focus now. Whoa! What is that? A wide one! Nasty ah. beast! Careful, lads! Ah. 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 Is this? It's from Helheim. Timed almost to grab this while I freed Garm. Ugh. I was there, but I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. No, you, you're right. We can return to the den through here. They will pursue. Keep your guard up. Father, how are you so sure we even have a choice about what we're doing? Doubt is a weakness we cannot afford. Who said anything about doubt? So far, we've done everything the Giants said we would. We make our own choices. Nothing forces us. We're walking straight into Ragnarok. Isn't there any way to avoid fate? Your fate? What if we can't stop you from... Would you turn your back on the wolves? On this realm? Remember our agreement. Hmm. 
The lad does make some good points, though. As long as Atreus lives, so be it. There's nothing. like inside their shrine. If I do this... Fate only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary. Not because it is written. to call them anytime we need them. Remember that altar we saw when we first got here? I think that's where we're supposed to use it. Huh. Perhaps Freya will know. So in essence, they just gave us the keys of dusk till dawn. Not bad for a day's work. We should head back to Hodespini and tell him about all this. Yeah? Yes. Back to the camp. humid, unfortunately. Oh! <laughs> 
same one from earlier, was it? No. They come back fast, but not that fast. In Asgard, what else did you see of Odin's army? Well... All these Anhuriyar we've been fighting, they've already died in battle once. We kill them here, and they'll just wake back up in Valhalla. They never truly die. Should it come to war, we do well to have our own endless army of dead soldiers. You mean Helheim's army, like the prophecy said. It will not come to that. like the egros We can get across from up here. So, we report back to Hildesfini, then what? We came here to help Freya. We will not leave without rescuing her brother and the Light Elf. Okay, but Odin's not gonna stop searching for mask pieces. That is his concern, not ours. Sure, but if that mask offers all the answers... Then it will surely exact a price. Be wary of shortcuts to knowledge. Yes, father. All the plants you want to kill us? Well, no, no. Only the carnaptious ones.
Ah, that wrinkly mug belongs to Helka. She's a blossinder. Hounds prized for their pinpoint accurate tracking abilities. You'll love her. Kratos, Atreus. That eclipse was your doing, I take it. Thank you for coming. Big Vir used the diversion to escape. What about your brother? We know where they're holding him now. Bale has already prepped the explosives. If you're with me, we can leave as soon as you're ready. I could use another shapeshifter's help. Go with him, Atreus. I will aid Freya. Yes, sir. I can Use stoke the fires of those chain blades for you. Once you see the signal, count it down. Thank you. Come, Kratos. We should get moving. Oh, hi! Hey, your little one. Well, he's a cute pie. Should have seen him a couple winters ago. Ain't even at eye level no more. Oh, you hush. Ain't nothing wrong with a growing boy. What's the Witch of the Woods need? Big man? Well, that's impressive. Brock, we need a new fate. The she... Let me stop you right there, killer. Brock ain't one to go breaking no confidences. Not even when it comes to the dearly departed. You don't hear me spreading your business all over town, do you? Smiths don't blab. It's just how it's gotta be. gave us a scepter. They will answer, should we call on them. Good. 
There's a shortcut to Niord's temple we can use in daylight. The Einher Yar are holding fair in your father's own temple. It's been empty for as long as I can remember. There's a celestial altar across the river. According to Bigvir, the altars were once used to signal the wolves. And now we have just the scepter to do it. What is your plan? When we reach the temple, I'll fire off the beacon. A signal for Bela and Birger to set off their distractions. The Dark Elf Hive. Night. To not be on the receiving end of it for once. With their attention drawn elsewhere, you and I can assault the main force from behind. While Atreus and Hildesfini slip in to rescue your brother in the confusion. Yes. Once we see their beacon, we'll regroup by the river and escape on Freyr's boat.
Get hit, Bubba! Hey, now you are! Left flank! Rallied more soldiers since our last visit. Hmm. Our disadvantages are many. Try dragging the scepter across the bell a few times. Come on, we're making good time. in this realm followed the prophecy the giants atreus believes ragnarok is inevitable the norns were quite clear on the nature of prophecy they told us the sum of our choices were predictable but we have changed haven't we perhaps Oh. 
Careful, brother. You're covered in my fraud. Steady your guards! <laughs> 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 The Norn said you'd kill Heimdall, but you chose not to walk that path. Back when we first met, I doubt you'd have done the same. And you? Do you still seek Ragnarok? Odin has much to answer for. If Groa's prophecy is correct, perhaps my realm can finally know peace. Perhaps I can know peace. Forgive me for being a head on a belt, but haven't we all just established the prophecy of pure havers? Gods, what? The most annoying man alive. More up ahead. On your mark. Careful, brother. You're covered in bygones. Find you.
Alpha, tough fight. This way. Alas, we're neat, Hog. It was in our way. I, I don't doubt it. Though. What was she doing here? Odin used roots of the World Tree as part of his spell that kept me from leaving Midgard. Neathhoek protects the tree's roots wherever they are. Ah, I see. Odin used her. And she unwittingly paid the price. Classic Odin. <clears throat>
just make extra noise once the assault ends. If we distract them long enough, Hildespini and Atreus will have more than enough time to get in and out undetected. I am not worried for Atreus. He is ready to fight on his own. This is it. There's an altar behind these vines. Call on Skull, please. Are you ready? I am. Are you? I'm not leaving here without my brother. Coming for you, Ingvi. Completely giving away your position. <laughs> what idiots! No. Oh. If it isn't Queen Mistletoe herself. Hilarious, by the way. Been a while. I'm dull. <laughs> and you must be the little half-breed's father. Lucky day! <laughs> you have a lot to answer for, Sunshine. You too, traitor. Better a traitor than Odin's lapdog. Hmm. <laughs> the burden is mine. I can help. I know. But you are needed elsewhere. He's right, you know. Sizzles wasn't looking so hot last I saw. I know you didn't want this. But we know how this ends. See you soon. Well, we both know that's not true. <laughs> but don't worry, Frigg. I'll be coming for you and your brother as soon as I am finished here. Now, what you got? Whoa! What did Cool Topher ever do to you? Have some life run on me! Yeah! Come on, you animal! So aggressive, so angry. Oh, did you want some more? Advantage? Nobody is 
coming to help. Queen Mistletoe is long gone. It's just you and me and that traitorous man. You are wrath! What the? I can feel your frustration, Phil. It is immensely satisfying. What now, brother? The spear remains our best chance. Hey, careful! These are new braces. Oh! <laughs> 
Oh, no, no, no. You are going to spare me out of pity! <laughs> Let it go, you may live. Is this about the little runt? Oh, now I am definitely going to gut him. <laughs> <laughs> This is your final warning. I don't think a warning is going to cut it. You think you get to just walk away? No. That is not how this works. <laughs> <laughs> Get to decide my fate! You are dead, sunshine. <laughs> you hurry way over your head! <laughs> Don't you know who I am? I am the Watchman of the Aesir, the Herald of Ragnarok! Ah! <laughs> 
pray to us. That was just... Uh, I don't know if we are breaking fate, or fate's breaking us. At least the rescue's going well.
them for long. seeing your faces. <laughs> Relax. It's flying. We're flying. I knew we would do that. Oh, yeah. 
Fremdur. Nu ir sjaldrīt sāma. Tad vedēna taldri dojur. Domu un daudzi. think that's the end of Birger? You think he survived that? He's down there picking the dirt out of his nails with the beast's feathers. You'll see. He... Uh, <laughs> he has to be. We're almost there, Ingvi. Just hold on a bit longer. I don't suppose I have much of a choice at the moment. Cloth and boiling water. Red root and lamb's grass. I know, I know. You think I never staunch a bleeder before? Oh, now don't you go worrying, boss. I didn't go through any of your stuff while you was off being tortured. Ah, damn it, Linda. Easy. Heck, you says to me for? I ain't the one who stuck you like a damn pig. No offense. Freya, mind giving her a hand? We're just taking over entirely? Hold still. She'll just get you stable so I can take you to Sindri's house. The rest of my herbs are there. We'll protect the realm in your absence. The four of us. Vadaheim's in good hands. Party at Sindri's house, then. Wherever that is. Your boat. Nope. Your boat. Go on. Take it. Sail the skies, sun yourself on its bow. You look like you could use it. <laughs> Make a Vanir god proud. He gave you his boat? Nice. He left me no choice. Because it was necessary, not because it was written. Galahorn is the Herald of Ragnarok. Whatever it does. I read about it in Odin's library. Supposedly it... Hold it, Treus. We will discuss in private. <laughs> 